In a joint operation with Delhi police, the Narcotics Control Bureau recently seized 50 kg of chemicals used to make narcotics. They also arrested three people, all from Tamil Nadu, who were trying to smuggle these chemicals abroad. Over the past three years, this group sent about 45 shipments totaling around 3,500 kilograms of chemicals used to make drugs. These chemicals were worth over 2,000 crore rupees when sold internationally. The shipments were headed to Australia, New Zealand and Malaysia and it was the US Drug Enforcement Administration who figured out that these shipments were coming from Delhi. The main person in charge of this 2000 crore rupees drug operation is Jafar Sadiq from Tamil Nadu. Jafar is not just involved in the drug trade, he is also a new movie producer in Tamil cinema. But what's significant is his role as a deputy organizer of DMK's West Chennai NRI wing. Investigations uncovered that Jafar, along with his brother Mohammed Salim and another individual named Maidin, acted as his accomplices. The chemical seized is pseudofedrine, which is used to make methamphetamine, a dangerous drug known as meth or crystal meth. It is highly addictive and an extremely popular and sought-after drug worldwide. The NCB received information from New Zealand Customs and Australian Police about drug trafficking via air and sea cargo hidden in food products like health mix powder and coconut shreds. To dismantle this network, a joint team of the Delhi Police Special Cell and NCB was formed. After four months of intensive surveillance, they raided a godown in Basai Darapur, West Delhi on February 15 and arrested three individuals. Jafar and his brother are currently evading arrest. Meanwhile, the DMK has expelled Jafar from the party permanently. Subscribe to the Federal's YouTube page for more news and updates.